Hey, what's up guys, it's Fritch. Welcome back to another video. Today we are playing some more Apex Legends, of course, and I have some more early footage once again of Apex Legends Season 9 or Legacy, as it's being called. Today I am focusing on the new Legend Valkyrie. I'm sure you guys have seen footage of her by now, but these are going to be my first impressions on the new Legend and also the bow check bow. I'll show you a battle royale game first and then I will talk over an arena mode game where I use the new Legend and the new weapon with my thoughts. So thank you for watching, I do appreciate it and I'll see you all in five and a half seconds my friends. This might be a good place to land. Uh -huh. Not a bad drop. This thing is so useful at the start of the game okay. to see where people are headed. I don't think we got anyone coming this way. Look at the minimap too, it's doing like this little radar thing. Can scan this area. Just to let you know that it's scanning everyone. Oh, hello. We good? I got the Mastiff. They're gonna be other guns. I don't think there's any anyone around, so we should be fine just getting loot. Never mind. That's not my teammate either, so that must be two separate teams that I somehow missed. I saw you going for that purple armor. Do you reckon I can get rockets in the window? Like, how horizontal is this? Not very, is the answer. Listen, you've got... There's a first time for everything. You've got to test stuff out. That's why I'm here. I have a variable scope on my Mastiff. Nice. I've used the scout quite a lot today, and it feels the exact same as it always does. I'm trying to, like, as I'm playing, I'm trying to think if there are any if there are any differences with the legends, or if there's any differences with the map or the guns. Um, Mastiff seems the exact same, and so does the scout. Hello, friend. Where are we going here? All right, so it doesn't do the radar scan if you just fly about. It's not if you're airborne. I think it must be if you're like in free fall. That. Sucks. But to be honest with you, if you're solo with no shield, you may as well go and play a new game. Get into a new lobby, get some teammates, and try again. Because you are just in struggle time, just roaming the, the map with nothing. There was one in that box, if he checks it, he'll get a level 1. I'm struggling on light. Need a shotgun bolt. What you got for me, Marvin? Shock and bolt? Sure, but I'll take it. That's not bad. Three bats. Okay, I've got the world supply of shield cells, as usual. Does anyone need any shield cells? I'm just going to leave them on the floor. They're all coming this way, so they'll see them. I'm in desperate need as well, teammate. I am very close to my ultimate. Do you guys want to zoom? Do you guys feel like zooming? Do you I'm clear here? Come on, Bloodhound. Yes, he's on the way. He knows what's happening. There he comes. How hard does this send you? Does, is this like... I mean, we've got a balloon on the right to see. We're, we're higher than that balloon. Actually, such a good rotation tool. And if anyone was here, I'd be able to see them with my with my passive as well, my little scan. So if there was someone to shoot, we could just land uh, basically on top of them. Would be the strategy that I would employ. Drop and bolt, light ammunition. Some extra light here, teammate. If you're still looking. Gonna revive. Big res teammates. 
Look how I can time an ability. The ability doesn't do the most amount of damage ever, but it does have like an extra stunning effect. So it should make firing at people a little bit easier as well. They're fine team, mess them up. This guy's won. Actually made that really comfortably. Good. I guess I have a way up top. That's the thing with Horizon. The Horizon managed to get her crypto teammate up top, but I can't unless I've got my ultimate. And that wasn't going to work out. All right, I'm coming back for you, teammates. Quick, get our teammates banner. These guys are in a fight. If I can make it to this rope and get across, grab the banner. We can give them another shot. Never mind change of plan. I could just be one guy, but I don't want to risk it here. Alright, I'll get the banners and I'll fly off to safety. Oh, it was you. Trying to collect the wrong banner. There are so many. So many Valkyries are based. Alright, cook Frez and we come back. Good thing here is that the Crypto and the Horizon have, have boxes that are on the way to where we're going to go. This third party. I don't want to run too far, just in case someone flanks us. I'll try and protect them a little bit. Alright, team. This is the mission. We've got to hoover up a box each, and we've got to get involved in the big scrap. It's a two-step plan. There's ammo in there. You don't need light on the R9. You're good. There's been a fight here for the last three decades. I missed. I'm missing. Yes, teammates got escaped too. Alright, nice tap strafe. Two octanes just walking around together. What's going on down here? Couldn't tap strafe that one. I'm risking your teammates, so you guys need loot. I can't see. I can't see. What's going on in here? No, oh, the Octane came back to save his friend. Scammed. No, I've got a self res, but. Sorry, Dad. No family reunion yet. I got a match to win. I mean, I have to pop. If they hear the shield back, they'll come and kill me. But if I see in the bike shed with no shields, I'm dead anyway. Guys are inside. I think I've got to. No, I can't. I was going to risk it, but. Are they going to start shooting each other? An absolute tragedy. A modern day tragedy. Not bad though. Fourth place. We got focused by everyone pretty much. Not sure what this team is. How is this team still alive? That's my question. They're all doing pretty good. Like, eh. I, had them, I had them on the ropes. So that was my best game of Battle Royale at the Capture event. I didn't get the chance to play too many, unfortunately, as the lobbies take a long time to fill up where there are only 70 to 80 people playing on the EU server. I did get some Valkyrie footage in the background in arena mode. It was a pretty relaxing 2v2 game and I was testing the bow check bow out as well. You'll see uh, in the game, but I do kind of struggle with the bow check. It's an incredibly fun gun to use, 
with the high risk reward factor, so I'm getting that practice in early. Now my thoughts on Valkyrie are that she is probably a middle of the pack legend in terms of effectiveness. Her rocket ability could have easily been overpowered. It's definitely intimidating when you're in a gunfight and you see loads of rockets come towards you. Uh, but the stun isn't too obnoxious, the damage is fair for an ability. It's just a, a well balanced bit of kit. Her ultimate is really cool. I think she may have a chance in competitive play because of how valuable rotational legends are in the pro scene. In public games, it's also great to get into your next fight a lot quicker, and paired with her passive of scanning the skies, it removes the guesswork of where the next scrap is happening. You just go airborne and land on someone's head. It's a simple plan, but it's very effective. Her flying passive is quite good, but man, you are so vulnerable whilst you are airborne in this. The movement is slow and predictable, but that's a good thing, especially after playing against so many horizons since the start of Season 7. It's going to be refreshing to see someone airborne, but they're going to be shootable for once. It's still really good though. You saw that I chased a Horizon in the game that I just showed you. Uh, it's not about crazy movement mechanics, but it serves a purpose as a scouting legend especially. High ground is underrated as well, so being able to fly up on top of any building or bit of cover is incredibly useful. You will have to be careful with how you use this ability, and that's a good thing. It's a risk reward factor. Overall, I think she's a fun legend. She's unique in the fact that she can fly, she has a damaging ability which is always good for a character's kit and a great ultimate for the squad. I doubt you'll see many solo queue sweat warriors picking her up, but her kit is fun enough and her lore is interesting enough that many players will main her in Season 9 Legacy, I'm sure. Now for this last round you can see me and a Horizon having a little bow check bow fight. First impressions on this weapon are that it can be incredibly good if you use it to its full potential. Am I using it to its full potential? Absolutely not. I am struggling. The good news is that a fully charged shot of the bow check bow does 70 damage to the body. So if I just keep peeking and let some arrows fly, chances are eventually I will nearly crack someone with that 70 damage shot just off one arrow. It is an incredibly satisfying gun to use though. I can't wait to use this weapon more on the battle rail mode and go for some really long range bow plays. I want to snipe someone off diving board from half a mile away. That's my dream and one day I will see it happen. So thank you for watching guys. I really do appreciate it. Make sure you are subscribing to the channel for more season 9 footage and I'll see you all in the next one. Mm, bye.